Hiya! Today I bring you a story that inspired me, a guy who's not religious, to believe in the power of faith. It's a story of the most religious man I have ever met. Hi, that is fun. Who spent 20 years in a lockdown, who was paralyzed, capable to move only one finger, and yet he never gave up. See, despite being locked down on the bed, Irfan taught himself English and with this one finger managed to write three books on his laptop, on his phone. Even if it took years to write one book, he never lost his optimism. And his books sold in thousands. Now, some of you might have seen this story before and unfortunately Irfan is not alive anymore. But one thing you didn't hear about was what kept him going. I remember when I asked Irfan how he stays so strong, he answered. For many years I struggled, but everything changed when I found my faith. I realized that I've been given life for a reason, and ever since then I make the best out of my situation. Yes, Irfan stayed positive in a 20 year long lockdown. Only because of his faith in religion, he was such a strong believer that he even fasted on Ramadan despite having a much weaker body than most of us. This is a lesson that when you believe, you can overcome anything. Right now, many people, including me, feel overwhelmed with the lockdown. It gets lonely, it gets sad. This whole pandemic makes you feel like giving up. And that's why this story is a good reminder that we are all capable of staying strong. It's a reminder that our problems can be resolved, that maybe what we go through is not as bad as we think. Coronavirus or not, all we need is faith. Some, like Irfan, find their faith in prayers. Others, like me, in a positive mindset. Whatever it is for you, I want you to believe. Believe that you can make it. Believe in a better tomorrow. Believe in other people. Believe in yourself. Believe in God. Anything that can make you stronger, please believe in it. And if you still find it hard, the next time you wake up feeling hopeless, think of how much it took to be strong in faith for Irfan. May his soul rest in peace while it keeps on inspiring us all.